In this video, we are going to solve the questions given in 7th standard max workbook. Term 1, Unit 1, Number System, Worksheet Number 2 Multiple choice question. First one, choose the correct number line which satisfies the sum. Minus 7 plus of minus 3. We have to sum the given number. While adding this we get minus 7 plus into minus we get minus. So minus 3. So the answer is minus 10. We have to check which line satisfies the value of minus 10. Option A does not give the value of minus 10. Then go for option B. See 0 to minus 7 and minus 7 to minus 3. We get minus 10. So option B is the correct answer. Then second question. Choose the number line which satisfies the sum. 6 plus of minus 5. We know that plus into minus is equal to minus. So 6 minus 5 we get plus 1 as answer. Check the number line. Option A does not give the value of plus 1. So go for option B. Option B. Option B give the values of plus 1. So option B is the right answer. Third question. Choose the correct number line which satisfies minus 8 minus of minus 5. See minus 8 minus into minus we get plus 5. With, while adding this we get minus 3 as answer. So check which number line gives the value of minus 3 as answer. First one. We have to mark minus 8 first, 0 to minus 8, then we have plus 5. So, so put 5 units forward. So we get minus 3 as answer. So option A is correct. Fourth question, the value of minus 25 into minus 12 is. We have to multiply these two numbers and put the positive sign. Because while multiplying the two negative signs, we get the positive value. So plus 300 is answer that is a fifth question rahim hires a harvesting machine at the rate of rupees 1250 per hour to harvest his paddy land the machine is used for eight hours per day if harvesting is held for five days how much will he pay for hiring rahim harvesting machine one hour 1250 pay pandranga so one day ke 8 hours on the machine work. So write 8 into 1250. We get 10,000. See and harvesting is held for 5 days. So he want to use it for next 5 days. So we multiply this value by 5. 5 into 10,000. We get 50,000. So option B is the correct answer. Then sixth one, the product of minus 35 into 4 into minus 10 is. See while multiplying minus 35 and minus 10 we get plus 350 and we have remaining 4. So we have to multiply this with 4. 350 into 4 we get 1400. So option A is correct. Seventh question. Which one of the following is not satisfied the commutative property of multiplication? We know the commutative property that is when two numbers are multiplied, the order of number does not affect the product. So check the options. Option A, minus 10 into 5 we get minus 50 is equal to 5 into minus 10 that is 5 minus 50. So this is satisfying the commutative property. Then go for the option B. We get 17 to minus 2 we get minus 140. In the right side also minus 140. So this also satisfying the property. Next C. Minus 2 into 5 we get minus 10. And right side minus 5 into minus 2 we get plus 10. So this is not satisfying the commutative property. So option C is the answer for question number 7. Eighth question, the value of minus 35 plus 50 plus of minus 85 plus of minus 285 is, we have to find the sum of the given values. So, negative integers are first add penikonga. 
while adding we get minus 405 and one positive integer is there so we have to add it with minus 405 we get minus 355 as answer so option a is correct ninth question which one of the following is correct for distributive property of multiplication over addition so take left hand side from options a into b plus c by this property we need to get a into b plus a into c check which option give the same impression option b is lies under distributive property of multiplication over addition for any two integers a comma b and a into b is also an integer which property of multiplication is this this is the property of commutative short answer questions 11th one if a equal to minus 71 b equal to 4 and c equal to minus 5 verify a into b into c equal to a into b into c see in the question we have to substitute the values of a b c same and verify both the left hand side and right hand sides are same see minus 71 into for b 4 and for c we have minus 5 equal to then a we have minus 71 into b we have 4 into c we have minus 5 so minus 71 first we have solved the numbers in bracket 4 into 5 20 5 have minus sign so minus 20 equal to Seventy one into four we get two eighty four. Here minus sign is present for minus seventy one. So put the minus sign into minus five. While multiplying minus seventy one and minus twenty we get plus one four two zero. Then right hand side two eighty four into five we get one four two zero minus into minus plus. So leave it as it is. Then left hand side equal to right hand side. Hence verified. Twelfth question. Find the value of x, y, z from the following. See this question is in the format of distributive of multiplication over addition. So write the property x into y plus z is equal to x into y plus x into z if x is here the value of x is 5 then in the place of y we have minus 7 and same here in the place of x we have 5 so write x equal to 5 and in the place of y we have minus 7 y equal to minus 7 and in the place of z we have 4 see here 4 here z and we have 4 z equal to 4 13th question find any 8 possible pairs of integers that give product of minus 20 we have to find 8 possible integers 5 into 4 is 20 we need minus 20 so put negative sign for one number so we get minus 20 as answer then minus 4 comma 5 also we get minus 20 then 10 comma minus 2 10 into minus 2 we get minus 20 and minus 10 comma 2 we get minus 20 20 into 1 we get 20 into minus 1 we get minus 20 1 into minus 20 we get minus 20 these six pairs give the product of minus 20. 14th question. The product of two integer is minus 225. One of them is 25. Find the other. Say x and y are two integers. They given the value of one integer. That is we consider x. x equal to 25. And we don't know the value of other one. 
so we have to find the value of y then the product of two integer is minus 225 x y is equal to minus 225 so substitute the value of x here 25 into y equal to minus 225 y equal to minus 225 divided by 25 while simplifying this we get cancel by fifth table 5 5 is a 25 5 4 is 5 4 is 20 remaining 2 then 5 5 is a 25 that is 5 then cancel it again by fifth table 5 1 is 4 and 5 9 is 45 so y is equal to minus 9 15th question how many years between 327 BC and 1728 AD so we have to find the in between years for that we have to subtract 327 from 1728 AD so that we get 1401 years so write in between 327 BC and 1728 AD we have 1401 years 16th question in a peanut land, there are 12 women are removing weeds. If the total wages is Rs. 2,280, how much will each get as wage? Write number of women removing weeds equal to 12. Then total wages is equal to Rs. 2,280. While dividing the total wages by 12, we get the wages of one person. So, divide by 12. By cancelling this, we get 190 rupees for one person. So, write wages for one person is equal to rupees 190. 17th question. During summer, the level of water in the pond decreased by 5 inches every week due to evaporation. What is the change in the level of water over a period of 4 weeks? Write level of water decreases a week equal to 5 inches. Then, level of water decreases in 4 week equal to we have to multiply by 4 4 into 5 we get 20 inches so the decrease in the water level is 20 inches 18th question Babu wrote a competitive examination which has scoring procedure of 3 marks for correct answer and minus 1 marks for wrong answer he had 50 correct answers and 25 wrong answer how many marks did he score in the examination See, score for correct answer is correct answer. He get 3 marks for 50 answers. So, 3 into 50. We get 150. And for score for wrong answer, he get minus 1. See, he, ha he had 25 wrong answers. So, into 25, we get minus 25. To get his mark, we have to sum this. So, we get 125. His score in examination is 125 marks 19th question 150 liters of water used from a water tank every day after 7 days there are 1500 liters of water remaining how much water was there in the water tank in the beginning write number of liters of water used every day is 150 liters 7 days they have used the water so 7 into 150 we get 1050 liters in the question they asked the level of water in the beginning so we have to add the remaining water and the 7 days used water so 1050 plus 1500 we get 2550 liters 
ट्वेंटी क्वेश्चन फिल इन द वैल्यू ऑफ ए बी सी अंड डी बै सूटबल इंटीजर इवस्टन एबिसी वैल्यू एना फैन पड़ चल एड व्यू फैवचना द आंसर विल बी जीरो वैल्यू आफ ए मैनस्व मैनस्टू बी की एं व्यू कुछ वन आंसरे कई कैनस्ट क्लस वन एट गेट कैनसल मैनस् वन इंटू मैन वन वि गेट प्लस वन सो बी इज ईक्वल टू मैनस्टन सी सी प्लस टेन सी प्लस टेन इज ईक्वल टू टेन वि हव टू फैंड वाट विल कम इन द प्ले आफ सी इफ वि पुट जीरो इन द प्ले आफ सी वि गेट टेन एस आंसर सो वैल्यू आफ सी इज जीरो इंटू मैनस् सेवन वि हव टू वि हव टू असैन अ नंबर दट गिव दैल्यू आफ मैनस् सेवन so put d as 1 into minus 7 so with that we get minus 7 as answer so the value of d is 